The series dates back to 1927 for the 94th time Navy and Notre Dame. And here come the Irish. Lavatai going to drop back to throw and get sacked by Kurt Heinisch. Second sack of the year, seven and a half sacks on his career. The pressure on again, and Lavatai is sacked this time by Jordan Botello. Rare you get sack opportunities against Navy, and back to back plays the Irish cash in. First and goal, it is Williams inside, leading to the goal line and in for a Notre Dame touchdown. Really nice job, good finish by this Notre Dame offense. You hand the ball to one of your best players. And what does Kyron do? He does what he does every game. He just carries guys into the end zone. He breaks tackles, yards after first contact. But a really good job finishing that drive off by Notre Dame. Irish try to convert on third and seven, and Cone fires to Austin, who's down. Kevin Austin will take it the distance. Notre Dame touchdown. Safety's job to get over there. He's not able to because Jack Cone holds him just enough. Flips his shoulders over there, fires it to Kevin Austin. That was one of my favorite plays. Our line option, ball free in the end zone. Safety. Our line falls on it. Kurt Heinisch was there, forcing the pressure. The Irish will get two and take a 13-point lead. What a day for Heinisch. From the 20, here is Williams bouncing to the outside, accelerating into the secondary, into the end zone. Williams, did he have possession over the goal line? Yes. Notre Dame touchdown, Kyron Williams. And there is Buckner back in here as they're inside the red zone. Part of the future, in the end zone, Diggs. Freshman to freshman, as the Irish and all. Right, we, something tells me we're going to be we're going to be calling out that connection for for a long time here, Mike. Logan Diggs, the patient runner that he is, finds the hole, walks in nearly untouched. Clock hit zero, and the Irish win 34 to six.